Hi everyone, I just watched Wasteland, an Academy Award nominated film, and I'm here with the director Lisa Walker to ask her some quick questions. So what was your idea to work with him? Where did that come about? I just liked his work, and I must say with all my films, I'm just, um, I'm, I'm lucky that I just feel like I can follow what I'm interested in, and I've learned that it, it, it seems a little indulgent to just kind of figure out what you're interested in and pursue that. But actually, it's a really good test because if I'm interested in it, that's the very best test I have for if anyone else is ever going to be interested in it. And I was just interested in his work, and I was interested in the puzzle of um, how do you take an artist whose work you really like and make a documentary that's got a story that's really interesting to watch. And I was lucky enough to get an opportunity to meet him at, at the time when we began the film. I was actually um, living in England, um, dealing with some family kind of stuff. So I was kind of there and very excited to meet an artist because I was sort of in need of some cheering up and some kind of fun project to think about and so I enjoyed thinking about it but I must say I wasn't sure that it would ever really go anywhere so I was very happy that it kind of did um, you know eventually grow into this wonderful project um, but it was just I just was interested in his work and sort of excited to meet him. <laughs> So this film I read took about three years to film yeah. and produce. What yeah. does a filmmaker go in with their mindset into a project? Gosh, you don't think about it too much because then you probably wouldn't begin. And also, actually, I must say, um, this project was more efficient than it maybe looks because there were lots of there was lots of work, but there was also lots of downtime in between. I actually was working on another film in the middle, and there were lots of twists and turns in the road, and moments where you have to set it down and wait for financing, or set it down and wait for a meeting, or set it down. And um, I never really mind that, um, especially in hindsight when you get to the finish line, because I sort of feel like it's almost like um, I was compare this to wine in bottles and I say if you've got a good wine in a bottle sometimes time is your friend and actually letting it sit for a little bit and coming back to it is actually the very best thing you can do to make it better. So well thank you very much Lisa. Such a pleasure, so nice to be here. Thanks. Be sure to stay tuned for more Odd TV.